everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Horde Control series. It is day 63. Um, the base has been repaired back up to full. I replaced the shotgun turret here with the SMG turret and aimed it towards the sky. Um, I find the shotgun turret really wasn't doing what I wanted it to do. It was supposed to clear the birds out, but I think it was firing on the steps and stuff too, which isn't going to do anything because the shotgun's really out of range for that. It would do very little damage. At least the SMG turret, now that it's up here, it should really just, it should just handle birds. It shouldn't be able to see anybody down there. Plus, I got a lot of uh, nine mil ammo that I'm not using, and I'm using the shotgun a lot more. So I'd rather hang on to my shotgun ammo and use up the nine mil on the turrets. So, um, <clears throat> started painting the base a little bit. Not really liking this color wall. I'll probably change the brick style to something else. Um, but I left the steel wherever it's steel it stayed steel so I know what's what is steel and what is not All the rest of this is reinforced concrete wherever we've got these kind of metal sheets. It's that's where I've got a plate um, Yeah, so I've got started uh, working on that now the base has been repaired back up to full um, These have been replaced everything behind here is steel now um, Same as this it's all steel and steel behind it most of it um, so I'm hoping that will be fine. I've extended this back a little bit back here because I know tonight we've got a higher game stage so there's a chance that demos can show up and I've also kind of gone around the bottom here. I've added steel plates all or steel to this side and some plates, not a lot, but this got, this is all plated on the side here. The ground is also uh, made into steel and up along here it's all steel now. Um, just because if a demo falls off from up here uh, and it goes off. I want to make sure that at least the underground portion of the base will be protected with steel Because it can blow through this concrete and that's fine as long as it can get back up onto here We'll be okay. Now I've extended this out a bit too uh, There's a little more steel on the ground because we're going to be shooting with the rocket launcher a lot tonight um, and throwing grenades um, I've changed my loadout slightly uh, I'll show you here in a second once we get back over so, um, we still have the shotgun, plenty of ammo, I mean, I got more back at the base, but I just brought what I had on me. I'm going to go with the uh, AK tonight with just armor piercing rounds. Uh, I still got like 800 more being made right now, and I've got so much gunpowder and brass that I can just keep making it. I don't, I don't need to go to standard rounds anymore. And we're going to go with the AK with that, because it is level 6. Um, so I've got, I've got uh, four mods on it, still the same... Um, same mods we had before. We got the muzzle brake, rad remover, clip extender, and the bipod. I don't normally go with the drum magazine because it just takes too long to reload, and I would rather have a faster reload. Uh, it's just my personal preference. I got 26 rounds now for the um, rocket launcher. I made I made like 10, but I was able to buy a whole bunch when I did a few trader runs. I got a crap ton of steel for repairs and forged iron, more than I'll ever need tonight. I bought some Atom Junkies. I'm thinking about using this part way through the night um, when we start getting uh, a bunch of guys down below. Explosion damage is plus 50%. Block explosion damage is 50% more. But these things only do 20 block damage. So it'll be doing 30 block damage, which is nothing. But the explosion damage will be over 1,000 with the rocket launcher. The grenades, not so much. Uh, it'll be 310 normally and then, what, 475 or 4, 465, 15 block damage. So, I mean, we'll use the grenades a bit, depending on what's down there. Um, if it's radi if it's like a lot of radiates, we'll go with the rocket launcher. Um, but if it's just mostly normal zombies, we'll just throw the regular grenades. Uh, i got to kind of use these up anyway. At some point, we're not going to use these anymore. Um, I do have the schematic now to make contact grenades, so, you know, we can make some contact grenades. And I'm going to throw three skull crushers down for the night. Just so we're ready to go. The time is it? We got an hour, so we're we're still pretty good. I'm hoping I can run the base. <coughs> excuse me. Mostly Millie tonight. Good drink. I got a lot of coffee on me. Um, that's basically our water. I bought a couple first aid kits and the usual stuff down here, just in case we need it. But I don't know. And then if for whatever reason the demos do a job on the uh, building, let's actually put this down here, and let's actually put all these down here. Uh, if the uh, demos do a job on the building. Um, for whatever reason we have to hop down and fight we're gonna we're gonna throw back one of these for the bonus run speed and we'll get down on foot and fight them on foot uh, but I don't see it coming to that um, our game stage right now 
Uh, where are we here? <coughs> so level 70, game stage 158. And I rounded it off. I made sure I got 3,500 kills. So we'll see exactly how many zombie kills we get tonight. Now, I think it was around 550 last time and 500 the time before. Um, so I'm expecting at least that tonight or more. So maybe 600 because we got a lot of rockets. Uh, I plan on using this a whole bunch tonight. I did not add the extra layer of, of um, wiring like I said I was going to do because I, I think I want them to stop here. I don't want them to stop one back because um, then I have to, sh then I'm forced to shoot them. If they stop here, um, that way the junk turret can knock them back and I can hit them, hit them in the head with the club. Um, also with the uh, demos, um, having the sledge on this side is generally a problem because um, if the demo is level with them, the thing is, with the sledge is, is it, it angles itself up and it tries to target the zombie's head. So it'll try and punch a zombie in the head. But because it's down lower, if a demo zombie is standing right beside it, it will generally punch them in the chest and not the face because demos are pretty tall, which means it has a chance to set the button off. But because it's down one block and the demos will be up here, most likely it will hit them in the legs and not hit them in the button. If it does hit them in the button, I can I can worry about changing this later on. Um, maybe even just taking that out, or I don't know what we'll do. We'll do something. But if it if it is hitting them in the button, you know we can deal with it tonight. I don't expect there to be too many demos tonight. Maybe three or four. Who knows? We make it half a dozen or so. But we got the rocket launcher to deal with that. If they show up and they and they are down, you know, kind of fighting down there. Um, we can just back up and blast them with a rocket launcher and hopefully that'll take care of it. Now I don't know if the rocket launcher if the frags will set off the demo button. If anybody knows, please mention it in the comments because I've never actually faced the demo in that in that way um, with a rocket launcher. So I don't know if, if it will actually go off. Normally I use the sniper rifle or some other kind of rifle to shoot them in the head. Um, which we'll do tonight. If they're in close, it's either going to be the shotgun or this. Now I went ahead, the skill points that I spent, we're almost ready here. The skill points that I spent, let's just go ahead and use these. Um, I put one into, um, what is it, armor piercing? Or what's it called? I'll find out here in a second. Let's use that. Uh, I put one into the penetrator. So we're ignoring 15% of their armor with firearms. And then we've got the AP rounds, so that should do a little better. All right, with nothing else we need to take right now. I'm going to keep this available. And let's see how we do. What are you shooting at? Are you actually shooting at the... I'm interested to know what you're shooting at. I wonder if it can see them on the steps. Oh, I should probably turn on the... Uh... There we go. All right, let's get rocking. Come on, you bastards. I'm right here. Oh man, groin shots are crazy. Just gonna pound another one of these back while we got a little bit of time. God, this... Come on, buddy. There you go. I gotta say, I know I've said it before. When I saw that um, junk sledge turret, I thought, what a useless piece of junk. But I love the thing. I never did like the uh, regular junk turrets all that much. It just kind of... I don't know. It feels like cheat mode to me. I think, if anything... You should have to have a battery in it. Because that's how they should make it. So that 
and the battery drains as it uses charges, right? So um, at least you only have a limited amount of time it can be used for before you gotta recharge the battery and get a new battery. Because it just seems a little overpowered. That's just my, you know, personal uh, take on it. Okay, still no demos that I can see, and I haven't heard any. A lot of uh, radiates, which is nice. Come on, you bastards. Oh man, those spiders. Die. He's still alive. I was just about to make the foolish comment like, Oh, I haven't been hit yet. You know where that leads to. Leads to me getting cocky and then, <laughs> and then taking a lot of damage. What are you doing? Presenting your groin? Okay, here. What are you, a masochist? Come on, you guys. This is working better tonight for some reason. I'm not sure why that is. There's a lot down there, though. God, it works so quickly. I guess I should really be uh, more aware. Don't waste ammo if you don't have to. Although I guess you get way more kills if you just you know, spray and pray. But this base was designed to be melee, right? So I want to see how long we can go and just kind of have it, well, it's really melee and grenades. Speaking of which, I think these guys down here deserve a little bit of attention. There you go. I only heard one explosion, there should have been two. I threw a, I threw a grenade down there to hopefully go off. Actually, let's just go ahead and... Uh... Alright, that dog bounced it off for me. Ah, I still only heard one. So the base uh, repairs last time didn't wasn't really that much. It's a really low cost base. Like you can spend a day mining, pick up a bunch of iron, just make steel in the background while you're doing other stuff. Then you come out here, repair the base, and it, it's like no, like no real time at all. Oh, you guys! Oh, you heard a cop. There he is, down there. Yeah, so the SMG turret is seeing something. I don't know what he sh these guys probably. Here comes the cop. I think we got him. Yep. I gotta say, out of all the bases I've made, in this game, and I've made quite a few, I like this one the best. It's the simplest to do. Ow, wow, you got a piece of me. And it works right from day one. You know what I mean? Like you can, I could have built the house, be ooh, sorry about that. I could have built the house right behind me. You know, and then just had this my door, like, well not my doorway, but you know what I mean. Oh, I guess I should drink some more coffee, huh? Let's pound a couple back. Get off my base, Mo. This junk sledge, man. I haven't repaired it since like time since the moment I got it. Oh, I missed. A 
Okay, looks like our... Yeah, it's about the right time. We've Our first row of electrical fence is uh, down now. Ah, uh, look at you guys. Uh, let's go with some grenades. It's weird. There's a weird bounce happening. Alright, those guys are messing around over there. The rockets are so cheap to make, too. They take a while to put them together, but they're pretty cheap. Alright, there you go. Right here, guys. Alright, we've got eight minutes in-game before we switch on the second set of fence. So we'll clear out some of these guys. Ooh, I got him just before he exploded, too. He was gonna explode. All right, let's turn this one on. Dance for me, dance for me. Wow, he took a lot of shots to the face there. Look at this. Ow, oh, someone got a piece of me. I think it was Mo. It was a good hit, by the way. We took that Mo out. Come on, you guys. I'm right here. Not going anywhere. So there was a discussion on uh, another uh, YouTuber site about um, how OP the... Uh, the um, electric fences are, and they totally are. They're totally OP. That's like the first time we like we saw cops, like I think on the second night, but we haven't seen them in quite a while. But yeah, the electric fences are kind of OP. They need to do something about it. I don't know what what they could do with it though. I don't know how you would make them a little, a little less um, controlling. Because I mean, like I said, I got two sets of fences up out here, and you know, I get hit once or twice, and these guys can't really do anything. They just stand there and get hit. I mean, and this is okay. This is an insane difficulty mob. Just, I mean, I guess I could up their block damage, but I don't know. That's just kind of. I guess I was really pushing the base design then, I guess. Because I can't up the base damage any more than what it's at right now. Well, yeah, let's not do it there. Get this cop, though. So the cops really aren't that threatening. Uh, unless they explode. Oh, what did I get hit by? Spit from something. Didn't do a lot of damage, though. Uh, I mistimed that. Thought you were gonna not bump into each other. Yeah, she's like, no, 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 I don't want to go up there. Don't force me to go. Oh, didn't think there was two of them. But you can see what, about, what I mean about the reload, right? It's like... It takes so long to reload. Nah. I'm not seeing where those grenades are landing. No demos yet. The cop spit's doing a good job on me. Let's just go ahead and uh, use one of these guys. 
All right, let's rock this. There's the demo. Oh, he's going off. See how that causes a problem? Did he blow the block up there? Nope, did not. I'm still good though. This will make it more interesting. That was a hard hit. I know, it's slowed down up here. I'm interested to see though, that demo may have destroyed the, uh, may have destroyed some of the, uh, what's it called? Uh, Cause it's not, our electric fences aren't working. Capper. Shit. Don't blow up. Wow, this is a really great horde night. Alright, let's repair this. There's another demo. What am I get hit by? Oh, how'd you get up here? The flashes are giving me uh, spasms here. Okay, he's dead. Okay, shoot low on the demo. Cop's gonna blow up. Oh, it sounded like he was. Yep, he did. I took a lot of damage from that too. Uh, do, 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 do. All right, well, fuck off. Yeah, let's give you guys some more. All right, we're gonna have to make a lot more. Um, what's it called? A lot more. Um, There's the morning. So it's nice that he's blocking the door. Get that cop gone. Die!
Okay, I like this Horde Knight. A little insane, but... Gonna have to solve the problem of the, uh... The doorway. The bars. I mean, I guess I could've... I got wood on me. I guess I could've made more bars and then just upgraded them. That probably would've helped. I should probably just keep some iron bars on me. So if the uh, demos do go off up here, then we got at least a uh, a way to replace the bars. There's another demo. Handful left. All right, so. We can afford to take the time now with this. Oh, you got through the hatch. Oh. Screamer. That demo on insane, man. He can take a lot of damage. Ooh, I need to fix that. Holy crap. Wait, where the hell did that go? She's still screaming. Got him. Let's find that screamer. What's up, buddy? Where's that screamer? Where is she? There you are. Got her. How many we got? Nine? Oh, let's not put it right in this guy's face, because that would be my face too. Come on, hit for crying out loud. Ow. Oh shit! <laughs> Make sure you're Reloaded. I should use a Mega Crust, but we're running just fine. Get that repaired. That'll solve us some problems. What's that guy doing? Two rounds left in here. How did I miss her? This biker is like angry at me. Okay, deal with you. Ow! Oh, it's a radiated cop. Because of course it is. Did that get hit by the spit? I think that's what happened. Where is he? I think he blew up. Spider monkeys. Oh shit. Did I get him? Got him. Oops. Oh, it's got an arc. Where are you, you bastard? Never did get around to using the atom junkies. Okay, you're done. You're done. 
Okay, you're walkers, you're walkers. Come on, I hope the loot bags don't despawn. Uh, Mom, I'm sorry. They've started to despawn already. Wow. That sucks. Well, not that it matters. I mean, all this stuff pretty much just gets sold anyway. Oh, hiding one in here. Well, at least you had a loot bag for me. Uh, let's drop some stuff in here. Well, we got a bunch of stuff to sell. I mean, I got a crap ton of, uh, of Dukes, so I'm not really that worried about getting this loot. What I want is to get the, uh, Military armor schematic. It's really the one thing I'm looking for. Everything else I pretty much got. Eh, it didn't look like we got it tonight. Anything up here? Nothing. Well, okay, so they broke through this level of steel here. I think that was the demo, but they didn't blast through the steel here. Oh, there's two bags in here. 228, some beer. Where's that beer? Definitely use one after that night. All right. Um, so this block didn't get destroyed. That block took a bit of damage. The demo went right off here. This one, I didn't bring any concrete with me, but not so bad. I mean, it's still intact. It, so we can take one demo explosion and I think one cop explosion at the same time. So we got to make sure the demos don't go off here. Um, yeah, but I mean, with the exception of that demo going off, the base did okay. Yeah, all our steel and stuff is down below. The bars stayed intact, although they did take a bit of damage. Not enough to be worrisome. Yeah. And I think maybe I have to reassess this turret. Maybe it was shooting birds. I'll have to, I'll have to look at the... Uh, oh, our secondary switch. Oh, that's what happened. The switches went. That's what happened. I think when the demo went off, it killed these switches. So I'll have to put them back here. Like this one is. I think so. Make sure they're behind steel. But these didn't get destroyed. Oh, there's a bag over there still. Two bags. Let's go grab those. So those didn't get destroyed, which is good. So I know if the demos go off, they're not going to blow them up. The book, but not the one we need. And yeah, more vitamins. All right, well... I'm sure there's probably more bags lying around, but I'm not going looking. So I had replaced all this floor with concrete too, and I'm kind of glad I did. Although it didn't take much damage down here. The floor down here, yeah, see, I, I don't know how many rockets I fired down here, but look, it's like almost no damage at all. And this is from zombies, right? This is with the same place I hit up last time. Well, they didn't take as many blocks out this last time. They did this time, and I think I wasn't... It's because I wasn't really spending much time looking down here at these guys at the beginning, and I probably should have. I should have been thinning them out a little more. They were hitting over here for a bit, but they didn't do too much. They got distracted and started hitting down here when I walked over. So they did a little bit of damage. I think a cop went off down here, which is why this one's damaged. Yeah, I don't know. I thought it worked out well. They were banging over here too, but yeah, they didn't really do too much. Alright, well, gonna make the base repairs. We'll come back on day 70. I think I'm gonna have to get that extra level of um, wire in. I think what happens, what we'll need to do is find a way to get it set back further so that when the demos come, I can stop them further out here. Just turn it on when the demos show, start showing up and then turn it off when they're gone again. I don't know. 
I'll figure it out. We'll figure something out. All right. Well, I'm gonna get this stuff back home. Let's go ahead and use this, and uh, we'll see y'all next time. All right. Before I forget, though, as I'm putting stuff away here to get sold, um, let's have a look at our game stage. So 163 now. We've got three levels, and yeah, just over 500 kills. 509. I think if I had been concentrating on the zombies down below earlier with the rocket launcher, I think we probably would have got a lot more kills. A lot more. We had one rocket left. Impact damage 309. That's it? It said 7... Oh well, whatever. Alright, end of the episode. Have a good night, guys.